all right text in bulk users i'm going to show you how to generate your google api key and how to enable the billing so that it actually work for you and you don't have any issues with this okay so i'm going to log in i'm logged in right now and i'm going to click on this google business leads and as you can see the message please enter your google api key in order to use the service and if I click on Yelp business leads, it will show me the same message. Please enter your Google API key first in order to use Yelp services because without putting your Google API key, you cannot use the location, automated location search for Yelp and also for Google, right? So as you can see, if I click on this button, you will get the place where you can put your Google API key. So I'm going to go to this URL right now which is console.developers.google.com okay which is the place actual place to get the get your api key and enable the apis so i have to log in with my gmail account so i am logged in right now and um getting some issues which should not be in your case but it's just nothing so ignore that and here i am here i am so i have to create a project right if you don't have a project created already you have to create a project first so i'm going to give the project name as in text in bulk demo billing one and you can leave the other uh, places as it is or you can just put anything so I'm just going to hit create right now now I'm going to go to the project so I have to go yeah so this is text in bulk demo billing one that's what I named it so here it is I'm going to hit it and here I am under this project right now okay so all right this is this is the first important step okay that you have to follow that I'm going to show you right now so as you can see if I click on this library okay I'm going to get this maps JavaScript API okay this maps JavaScript API I, I have to click on it and then I have to enable it so you guys also have to do the same this is very important this is one of the API that you have to enable maps JavaScript API and the other API is places API which I'm going to do just after this so I'm going to do this going to the I'm going to go to the same place which is library and I'm going to search by places and here it is places api so i have to do the same process i have to just enable it okay this is the two apis that you have to enable actually to make it work okay so if i now if i go to my dashboard i'm going to see these two apis see perhaps javascript api and places api both are enabled in my case okay so now the second step is to get your actual credentials which is get your api key right so i'm going to show you again credentials so api services and credentials okay so i'm going to click on create credentials and api key so this is now it's actually creating my api key and i got my api key right now so here it is my here it is my api key so i'm going to copy it and I'm going to paste it but I'm not going to save it because I haven't enabled the billing yet third important step which I'm going to do enable the billing so I'm going to search it by Google Maps API enable billing and I'm going to get the first link yes and I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna click on this enable billing okay I'm going to continue with it so I have to log in again with my Gmail account and I have to select the project that I had created text in bulk demo billing one 
and I selected it and I should be all good to go. See, I'm, I'm all set. Billing has been enabled. So this is the third important step. Three, three steps you have to follow. First step, enable the API keys. Google places API key and the Maps JavaScript API. Second, get the get uh, get the API, and third is enable the billing. This is the three important steps that you have to follow to make it work. So now, as you can see, I have already pasted my API key, and if I refresh the page again, I will get the location search work properly. So I'm going to do it, and I'm going to type a location. Yeah, so it's came. That means it's working. So that's it, guys. That's it for now. I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.